all right guys well i kind of skipped over a couple steps here i got in too involved in the cleaning and taking care of everything um but the cart is pretty much cleaned up um i do kind of leave it apart um so once i got everything all cleaned up and stuff like that wiped down with uh what i use is a uh, gojo wipes like to clean your hands that's what i use kind of to clean the chassis and everything but um and then after that i wipe it down with uh wd-40 um and that kind of good stuff that gives it kind of like a good good overall shine and then uh obviously protects it so i got my cassette bearings and stuff like that and the color night for the night like i said i'm in no hurry um i did want to get it all cleaned up and get the bearings out of it and uh cleaned up so we'll be uh on it tomorrow maybe tomorrow a little bit more um i think i'm gonna let the bearings probably sit a day or two um and then uh because after we're getting cleaned so but that's about it and the uh the engine uh got wiped down i like to wipe that down the same way gojo wipes get all the gunk and uh, uh rubber material comes off all the other carts um and then I hit that with WD-40 also. The exhaust, I always try to hit it with WD-40 after like almost every run. It kind of just cooks the WD-40 on there and prevents it from rusting. So, um, but that's about it. Like I said, I really, I put the front bumper back on it just so it would be easier just when I load it back in the trailer. Um, but other than that, pretty clean, happy with it. So and every time i work on it i always wipe it down and just give it a kind of a one last shine and remember i'm cd <laughs> so but yeah that's about it give her a good old shine and go from there thanks guys for watching um so we got the rest of this week next week and friday night and saturday night we'll be in orlando so come see us come race with us and uh hopefully it should be a good turnout and uh good racing i got a uh got a new visor coming in um it's the ember one i'm gonna try that out since it's a night race i want to make sure i have minimum glare um so i'll get that in i'll have uh, probably a front strip done to it and a bottom strip i kind of like that look I don't know if doesn't like it, but I do. I think it looks cool. I did it to my gold one, and I was, uh, I'm was i pretty happy with the way it looks. So, But thanks again for watching, guys. Um, that's basically it. I'm probably going to do a video putting back, putting it all back together and stuff like that. So um, tires, I'm probably going to run those same tires uh, until I get new ones in Orlando. So maybe. I don't know. I was pretty quick on those tires. We'll go. We'll see how it goes. So, um, as you guys notice, is the no more floor pan. So it's not that it's not legal. It's just that SSKC doesn't run by the WK rules, which uh, that is in the rules for WK on the road racing side and man cup side. So Orlando does. Um, go by wk rules so it was always legal in orlando um but i'm not gonna run it probably this uh orlando weekend and then uh so uh that way i don't have to take it back off for sskc and all that good stuff so because i do apply by all the people's rules so but again guys thanks for watching i'm gonna load it up get some dinner and uh go on the rest of the week thanks